Oh. So, I got a new, I showed you this, so I, I showed you guys this already, but I had the issue one of Black Panther, The Long Shadow. But with all that's going on right now, I was like, you know what? This was actually a really strong story thus far. The first issue was really strong. And I was like, I wasn't going to read any more Black Panther. Um, you know what I'm saying? Because I was like, all right, you know, I'm, I'm good. But, you know what I'm saying? I was like, I've never really read a strong Black Panther comic book arc. So I decided I was going to get uh, one through five of... Black Panther, The Long Shadow, and there's probably like, I think there's like, it's like seven more, seven more um, issues, you know what I mean? But, that brings me to this point that I wanted to discuss with my wife, mm -hmm. of why I think it would be sad in a disservice not to have T'Challa, uh, T'Challa as Black Panther in any more Marvel movies. Uh, I honestly think it would be unfortunate because, you know, T'Challa, to my understanding, is the bulk of the Black Panther comics. You know what I'm saying? Now, you know, switching from different platforms, you know, they can do whatever they want. But I'm thinking if he is the, you know, if he's the bulk of the Black Panther story, why wouldn't we as fans want to see more of T'Challa in his element? I mean, did we really even get to see him in Wakanda? Really? No. You know what I'm saying? More than one movie. And it, it was... I'm trying to get comfortable, y'all. I'm trying to figure out how I'm going to tap this video... You know what I'm saying? This is a WTW, by the way. Hi. I got my wife with me. You know what I'm saying? I just I just had to talk about this, man, because everyone else is talking about this. You know what I'm saying? Everyone got their strong opinions. You know what I'm saying? Let me, like in a way, me. there's kind of like a division now being created, you know, now that, you know, with Chadwick's passing. You know, we're a little tired right now. I feel like there's like a division, though, because there's one group that's like, okay, let's move on. Let's get Shuri as the Black Panther. You know what I'm saying? And I feel like people are, you know, there's some people that are saying, oh, well, there's some people that don't want us. They just don't want to see Shuri as the Black Panther because she's a female. And, you know, there, there are those, possibly those groups, you know what I'm saying? But I, small group. yeah, I think they're a small group. And I think that's kind of, but I think what, what is being like, what's disingenuous about that is the people that want to see T'Challa again are being painted with that same brush. Yes. You know what I'm saying? And I think that's disingenuous. You're like, oh, you just don't want to see a woman be the Black Panther. And it's like, no, I just want to see T'Challa be the Black Panther in the, in that story arc that he didn't get to finish. Mm -hmm. That's not me being, you know what I'm saying, sexist. You know, I just wanted to see T'Challa because he didn't get to flesh. We didn't get to flesh out his story we didn't get to see him in his you know well and i really think that part of this problem is that there is a difference between t'challa and t'challa's story arc in the comics and black panther and black panther's story arcs in the comic and for majority of the comic t'challa is the black panther but black panther is an entity that is held by multiple people whereas t'challa is a character similar to um clark kent or bruce wayne right like it's it's clark, not... right right he he's synonymous with uh black panther you know right. what i'm saying so there's, it's there's... like it, mm. you know right that's exactly what you know what i'm saying that's exactly what i wanted to touch on you know what i'm saying you know yeah chadwick boseman passed away you know what i'm saying and that's unfortunate. But there's all these people that said, that have said, when that Black Panther movie came out, they said it was a cultural phenomenon. It made a billion dollars. But people fail to realize, or they quickly forget, that um, Chadwick Boseman was the lead in that movie that made a billion dollars playing T'Challa. 
Right, playing so, as T'Challa. And yes, he passed away, but that doesn't mean that just because he passed away, T'Challa has to go with him. You know what I'm saying? And just eliminate and, 90% of the story arc that he has in the comics. Right, and I just feel like... I just feel like that is... You know, that's something that, for me, it just feels like they said, oh, well, he's the first black superhero to have a big hit movie. That's not true. Blade was the first uh, was the first black superhero to come out from Marvel and Spearhead. Basically, Spearhead, their, mm-hmm. their beginning. Um, but, but in this recent set of the MCU, he is, you know, one of the dominant black superhero characters yeah he's the i think he's the only one and so right (laughs) right of the of the yeah who else who who else did they have besides chadwick boseman being the uh a a black a black lead of his own superhero movie in marvel crickets you know what i'm saying and so but but i mean let me just you know bring it back around let me just bring it back around uh, to the point I wanted to make because I'm just rambling. But, uh, you know, Charlie passed away. But the character shouldn't pass away with him. See, that's the whole thing I don't like. You know, we you know, we spend so much time, um, you know, trying to... Uh, nowadays, people want to make these fantasy shows and these fantasy books and all that resembling... I mean, resemble real life. And it's like, why are we doing that? It's called fantasy for a reason. Fantasy for a reason. A lot of people are like, oh, well, it's escapism. Well, it's fantasy. So by definition, it's escapism. You know, yes, you can have real events, talk about real events in, in fantasy. But like, um, I just don't think that it should, you know, this whole, you know, let's bring the real world into fantasy all the time. I think it's gotten to a point where it's just, it's kind of just eerie. You know, mm-hmm. it's really eerie. And you think of Chadwick passing, it's like, you know, respectfully passed away. But at the same time, I think the child should still keep going. You know, um, I, you know what? I'm just going to say it. I'm just going to say it. <laughs> Are you sure? Because I'll say it. No, nah, I'm, I'm just going to say it. You know, Chadwick passing, I feel like maybe this, this is, I feel like this is something that uh, you could say this is something that only black people are gonna have to deal with. You mm-hmm. know what I'm saying? Our black, you know, our superhero died, so they're not gonna make any more, you know, superheroes. They're not gonna make any more T'Challa's. You know what I'm saying? It's like that's ridiculous because because if an act, you know, if an actor who played Bruce Wayne died, they're not. You think they're gonna stop making Batman? Mm-hmm. If, They've recast if a character, three or four if, times. if an actor that played Spider Man died, you think they're gonna stop making Spider Man? You know, they think they're gonna stop. Also been recasted three or four times. You think they're gonna stop making Peter Parker? If right. uh, who else? Uh, if you know, Clark Kent. Uh, yeah, you think? Yeah, are they gonna stop making Clark Kent Superman? No. Like this is like, it, it's weird. It's just weird and like, just, and it's got some undertones that yeah, are it's got, uh, it's got untasteful. Some, yeah, it's got some weird undertones, and it's just like you know. Uh, and they just retired him so quickly. Right. It was like, they oh, he died. Him. Oh, by the way, you'll never see T'Challa again on the big screen. And it's like, wait, wait, what? I'm sorry. How are those two connected? And like, how are why, you just going to use like, that? Why? Like, I'm, I'm, like, I think that it, 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 it hurt the community of Marvel that he passed away. Absolutely. Us, us as fans that really got gravitated to that movie. But at the same time, it's like... You, you. So those people that had all that, you know, what I'm saying all that goodwill towards the movie and mm-hmm. love seeing T'Challa finally in his own movie. Right. You're telling us that we're somehow bad now because we feel like that character is so big that he should live on through other actors. Right. We're we're bad guys now. Mm. Like, Mm-mm. I thought that's what the whole thing was for. Like, yes, it's a mantle. You know, but like, let's not let's not act like we're bad guys just because we want to see T'Challa. You know what I mean? Right. Uh, being played again by another actor with another story arc. I mean, there's so right. much. I mean, to my knowledge, they've been making they've been making 
Black Panther comics since the 70s? Right, and T'Challa has been the Black Panther for like 90% of that. Yeah, and... and, and with Shuri being the Black Panther, our respect awesome. To, our like, respect to Shuri, um, she... Her comic book run was maybe like 2% of that, 5% right. of that. So it's like, you know, we're not in the wrong for wanting to see T'Challa's story or his stories fleshed out on the big screen. I mean, it made a billion dollars. Uh, but it also needs to be said that just because we want to see more T'Challa with a different actor, that doesn't mean that we are like anti Shuri being right. Black Panther. Like I can want to see Shuri be Black Panther and want to see T'Challa and see again. T'Challa again. Like I can want those at the I same mean, time. It's not like they don't it's not like they don't have different variants of other... Right, we're already going into time we're warp the, we're zone. We're there, we're there, you guys. We're in the multiverse, so why are you right. guys... Right, why come, is it so Why are strange? you guys mad that we want to see another T'Challa? T'challa. Like, what? Like, how is they that had, an impossible What, they thing had, to like, do? five Doctor Stranges in the last... Right. In the Doctor Strange movie? And it's so crazy that Marvel was like, we're not recasting T'Challa, when you knew you was gonna go with this whole time variant thing and see, that's so a like whole, why that's would a, you make that decision that's a whole can of worms I mean mm. shit I mean just to kind of change the subject but not really I wanted to see Tom Cruise as, <laughs> as <laughs> Iron Man <laughs> I mean I wanted to see it I seen mm-hmm. some pictures where he was uh, he was um, oh, I forgot what that Iron Man was called but yeah he was supposed to be some you know I seen art, art pictures put together of him as like invincible Iron Man or something like that or I don't know this some type of variant of of Iron Man. I'll probably post a picture up here, but it looked solid. I was like, damn! And I actually mm-hmm. consider I actually consider to, uh, Tom Cruise more of an action star than Robert Downey Jr. Uh, hot take, I guess. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> I mean, the guy no, right, the guy already... jumps out of planes and. <laughs> You know. does his own stunts and he's like 50 I mean, he's 50, like, 60 oh, or something come on Tom Cruise is as Iron Man but no one will ever be T'Challa again like yeah ugh get over yourself that is so that's so bogus yeah I think yeah man I just I just um I just think that it's insulting to people that wanted to see that that want to see T'Challa live on you know what I'm saying yes I think it's okay for the mantle to be given to someone else. That's totally fine. Honestly, that'd be cool. You know what mm-hmm. I'm saying? That'd be cool. That'd be awesome. You know, I would look. It wouldn't I, and, hinder and, it at all. And here's the thing. And here's the thing. Before people come for me, because I feel like you know what I'm saying they might. Um, I'm gonna see Black Panther two. And I'm gonna me, enjoy every me and my wife, of it. Me and my wife are gonna see Black Panther too. I'm gonna show you just like I show you guys every other movie that I'm excited about. I go to the theater, I show that I have my camera on the poster before I walk into the theater. I'm gonna do the same thing with Black Panther too. But I'm gonna tell you guys this. Uh if they want if they are gonna make a Black Panther three, I want a T'Challa. Mm-hmm. I want T'Challa in Black Panther 3. I want T'Challa in Black Panther 3. You know what I'm saying? It's going to it's gonna be hard for me to want to see Black Panther 3 if T'Challa is not in Black Panther 3. And, um, you know, that's another thing. I want Black Panther 2 to be great. Mm-hmm. Make no mistake. I know that he's passed away, but I'm not going to subvert my expectations because I think they have a great cast that can pull off a great Black Panther movie, despite the loss of the late great Chadwick Boseman. You Absolutely. know what I'm saying? 